Morning Palace by Dimu Borgir. So the song's in standard tuning, and it starts with the keyboards. <laughs> And then the guitar comes in with that lick, which is um, just power chords all on the A string, frets two, five, four, seven. So that little lick, we're playing two on the bottom string to four on the D, two on the bottom, and then two on the G. Then we got that those chords. Then for the main section, we, we're playing power chord on the second fret. And then we're going to play those chords. So that's power chords on the second fret of the bottom E string. Then which is again is two, five, four, seven on the A. The other guitar. So we're playing power chords on the bottom string, second fret. Then we're going to play an F sharp minor chord, which is on the ninth fret of the A string. And then we've got those power chords again, two, five, four, seven. Then we've got both guitars playing. So power chords, second fret of the bottom string, and then we're going to mute on the bridge. Then 7th fret of the A string, then we're going to play a major 3rd on the bottom string, which is 7 on the bottom string, 6 on the A. So. And repeat that, and then at the end... going to play ninth fret of the D string. Then we've got those chords again and then we're back into the main riff. Then we're back into can play that and play that down there instead, which is two and one on the D. And that's two on the A, one on the D instead of seven and six. So after that, we're going to play an E minor chord, which is just an E minor on the seventh fret. Then we're going to play. So we're playing 7th fret of the D, 5th fret of the G, then 7 and 4, so then we're going to play 7 on the D, G, uh, 7 on the G, and then 7 on the D, 5 on the G again, so that's, and then we're going to play 7 of the A to 5 on the G, Sorry, five on the D. Four, five, four. So that one on the seventh stays there, and we're going to just play five, four, five, four on the D. So over the top of that, the other guitar is just playing power chords on the fifth fret of the E string. And then the open E string. Then we've got this riff. Then 
So, muted on the bridge, then we're going to play it on the 7th fret of the A string to the 9th fret of the D, and then 7 to the 8th of the D. So that's two, two times on the A, one time on the D, and it's all triplets. And then we're going to play power chords on the A, 3, 5, 6. So, slowly. So it sounds as though the other guitar is playing. So, instead of playing, we're playing the same on the E of the 7th fret of the A, but then we're playing 9 and 8 of the G instead of on the D. And again I'm muting the bridge. And then we've got the power chords on the A, 3, 3, 3, 5, 6. Then we're going to go into... So again, muted on the bridge and open to open bottom string to three of the A to two of the A. Open bottom string two of the D. Open bottom string one of the D. So that's then open bottom string. 3 of the A, open, 2 of the A, and then the power chords again, so slowly, then the riff changes from triplets into quavers. So, 7 on the A to 9, then to 8, 7 on the A to 9 again of the D, and then to 8 of the D, then the power chords. So slowly. both guitars play that riff. Then we're back into these chords again. But I think it's played a bit faster this time. And then the other chord is... five to open. So again those notes are seven on the D, five of the G, seven of the D, four of the G, seven of the D, seven of the G, seven of the D, five of the G, and then on to the A and D, seven on the A, five on the D, seven on the A, four of the D, seven of the A, five of the D again. And then back to finally 7 of the A, 4 of the D. And those power chords are again just 5 on the bottom string and open bottom string. Then we've got a tremolo picked riff. So we're playing. Um, again, it's all tremolo picked. So on the A string, two, four of the D, two of the A, five, four, two on the D, three of the bottom string, five of the A, three of the bottom string, open bottom string, two of the A, five, 
of the D and then four of the D. So. Over the top of that riff, it sounds like the other guitar is playing a B minor chord down to a G major. And I'm not too sure if he's just strumming it or if it's a tremolo pitch. But it sounds like that's what's going on over the back. So B minor down to G major. Then we've got this riff. So, on the A string, fret 2, to 4 of the D. Back to 2 of the A. Then on to the D again, 4, 5, 4, 2. So that's... Then we're going to kind of repeat that. So on the A, two to four of the D, two of the A, four, five of the D, and then we're going to pick a harmonic on the fourth fret of the G. So then we're going to repeat the first bit again. Then we're going to play three of the bottom E, five of the A, three of the bottom E, open bottom E, two of the A, five to four of the D. So slowly. Most of that, by the way, is muted. Then we're back in tune. That riff there. So amp settings, I'm using the Black Star HT5R head into the orange 2x12, uh, sorry, orange 1x12 cab. I've got gain at about 1 o'clock. Uh, bass is at 3 o'clock. Middle is at 3. And treble is at about 1 o'clock. And I've got it on the ISF American side. <laughs> 